Hello my dear students and viewers welcome to my channel Scorpio class In this video we are going to discuss the revised syllabus 2022 of class 8 history chapter Sanatan Dharma We are going to discuss the question and answers of this chapter so this video is going to be very helpful for you all so stay tuned till end and do not miss any part of it And my dear students and viewers if you want all the other lessons explanation and the notes of revised syllabus 2022 of history Paul Science Sociology you can visit the playlist link which is given in the description box and click on it and watch the entire videos the playlist link will also be shared in the i button above so you can watch each and every lessons notes question and answers in this channel so it's going to be of great help now let's get started but before that if you are watching my video for the first time to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get the notification of all the upcoming videos and also share it with your friends as much as possible now let's get started with our notes section and first main we have complete the following sentences with suitable answers first question is the other name of sanatan dharma is dash answer is hindu dharma hindu dharma second upanishad is a part of dash answer is vedic literature vedic literature next the word veda is derived from dash root sound vid it is vid okay next fourth one the meaning of vid is dash answer is knowledge knowledge fifth one the one that is heard is called dash and the one that is memorized is dash so first blank it's shruti and second blank is smriti the one that is heard is called shruti and one that is memorized is smriti next india's two main history works are dash and dash ramayana and mahabharata ramayana and mahabharata next the indian philosophical pillars are dash upanishads answer is upanishads next the vast area of philosophy that derives origin from shakta gama is dash answer is tantra tantra okay so here we finish with our fill in the blanks that is complete the sentences Now let's move ahead with the question answers. Second main answer the following question in brief. Question number is continued. It's ninth question. What is the meaning of Veda? Answer: Veda is the entire body of Hindu sacred writings in Sanskrit. The word Veda is derived from Dhatu Vid, which means knowledge. Vedas. are the basic foundation of sanatan dharma next question how many mantras are there in rigveda how are they grouped answer rigveda samhita has 1028 suktas 10552 mantras all these mantras are written to literary meters of gayatri ushnik Puraushnik, Kakuk, Anushtup, Bruhati, and others. Suktas are further classified into eighty-five Anuvakas and ten Mandalas. Those who study Rig Veda in traditional ways classify it into eight Ashtakas, sixty-four Prapatakas, and two thousand twenty-four Vargas. and 10552 mantras next question name any two poetic meters used in rigveda answer gayatri and ushnik are the two poetic meters used in rigveda here you can also write students the other names which are given other poetic meters which are given in the textbook here i have written only two that is gayatri and ushnik because it was asked only two in the question 
So any of your choice, you can write it from the textbook also. Next, twelfth question. Name the four skandhas of Vedas. Answer, Samhitas, Brahmanas, Aranyakas and Upanishads are the four skandhas of Vedas. Next, who classified the Vedas? Why? Answer, Krishna, Dvaipayana Maharshi classified and divided the corpus and came to be called as Veda Vyasa. The enormous corpus of Vedas existed during those times was so huge that it was practically impossible to study and teach all of it in one human lifetime. Thus, it was classified into four Vedas, Rik, Yajur, Sama and Atharva. Next question. Name the four key sects of Shakti, Vishista, Advaita. Answer. Kashmira Shaiva Darshana, Shaiva Siddhanta, Veera Shaiva are the four key sects of Shakti, Vishista, Advaita. Next question. What is the theist literature? Name to theist text. Answer. The entire religious literature of Sanatana Dharma can be bifurcated into Vaidika and Avaidika. Those who believe in Vedas, the theory of karma and rebirth are theists. All the literature that believes in this are theist literature. Rig Veda and Ramayana are the two theist texts. Next question. What is a sutra? Give examples of sutra literature. Answer. Several treatises, that is Vedangas, that are written to explain Vedas are in the form of sutras and hence known as sutra literature. Sutras are unambiguous, made of minimum words, formed to give complete meaning and universal statements. Sutras can be compared to modern words, equations and formulae. Patanjali Maharishi's Yoga Sutra, Gautama Rishi's Nyaya Sutra, etc. are all sutra literature. Next question. What is the difference between Sanatana Dharma and Semitic religions? Answer. The followers of Semitic religions have to believe in one prophet, one god and one religious text and have to follow the commandments issued by the god through a messenger. In Sanatana Dharma, there is no concept of one god, one prophet, one text, and one set of commandments. Multiple deities worshipped in Sanatan Dharma are only forms of the creator of the universe, the Supreme Brahma. Sanatan Dharma has space for both Vedic and Avedic literature and traditions. Sanatan Dharma has space for both theist and atheist religions. The intent of Sanatan Dharma has been Ano bhadra kratavo ya natu vishvatha. Let noble thoughts come to me from all directions of this world. Next question. What is the key message of Sanatana Dharma? Answer. The key message of Sanatana Dharma are Let us hear and speak God. Let us inculcate good behavior. Let us live happily with good health. Let us give up hatred and jealousy. Let us not commit violence and treachery. Let us respect gurus and elders. Have devotion in deities. Let us earn knowledge by walking in the right path to our fullest strength and character. Okay, so these are the key messages of Sanatana Dharma. Now, what these questions 
question and answers we come to an end with this session the notes of this chapter and the video also ends here i hope this answers were helpful for you all if this video was helpful and if you liked it do hit the like button and share it with your friends subscribe to the channel scorpio class and stay tuned for more such videos thank you